With the trumpet and congas in place, it is now time to tackle the double bass. Create text that reads double bass in the front view. Set it to a size of about 120 and use the Broadway font for it. Extrude it by about 70 or 80 units and rotate it to stand up as you did with the congas. Add a Quadrify Mesh modifier. You may need to play with the percent value later. Add an FFD Box modifier and set its number of points to 3 by 8 by 3. Play with the control points to get a shape you like. Start by curving the front and back by slightly scaling the center column in the top view. You can then select the second and fourth rows in the front view and scaling them horizontally. Keep on adjusting control points until you get a shape that you like. If vertices start to pinch, adjust the control points to minimize distortion or you can try a different percent value in the Quadrify Mesh modifier. Use the Reset X Form utility to reset the object's local orientation. Add a UVW Map modifier and create a material for the base based on the provided bitmap. You will need to adjust the mapping coordinates so that the wood grain looks reasonable. Once you're happy with the result, collapse the object to an editable poly. As you did earlier, relocate the pivot point so that it is at the base of the instrument. To keep things tidy, rename the various objects by their instrument's name bass, trumpet, high conga, and low conga. Go to the Slate Material Editor. Notice the bitmap you imported earlier. You will set it to appear as a scene background. Double click it and set it to work in Environment Screen Mode. It will simply act as a camera backplate. Press 8 to display the environment dialog and then instance the map as an environment background. Close all windows and test render the perspective view. You still need to adjust your view and in order to help with that process simply merge the file named addons.max. It contains a camera, two lights, and a circular ground to catch the spotlight. Switch the perspective view to display the camera view by pressing the C hotkey. You still need to adjust the position and rotation of the instruments to fit the camera shot. For that, it's easier if you display the background image in the viewport. Press Alt-B and enable Use Environment Background and Display Background. Make the necessary transform adjustments. Also make sure your rendering is set to Mental Ray for final render. In the next movie, you animate the musical instruments.